Hey, this is like a Coleman or something. Nobody's kid grew. Do you have uh, Windows XP or uh, pretty much, you know, any version, ultra, uh, professional, home premium, or media center? And uh, I know Microsoft's new OS Vista isn't the greatest uh, OS that they could have came out with. I actually prefer Longhorn over that. But, uh, you know, uh, I love the look of Vista. I like the look. I know some people just like to go simple and use the Windows 95 theme, and which will actually produce some better speed for your uh, computer. And be this is what I, it's called the Vista Transformation Pack. As you see, the t type of aero glass look, the transparent look, the Vista logo. Now, you see it doesn't have the search bar, the features, it's most, most features, but most of the program, uh, most of the great look, all the logos are there, all the, I, I mean, oh, sorry, logos and icons are there, and, you know, you can even get more things to make it look like Vista and more features. Excuse me. Today, I'm going to show you a Vista transformation pack, which, uh, pretty much changes your whole PC, or, I mean, your, or your computer shell look, or your shell, which is the look of it, uh, to Windows Vistas. Now, before I go on, now, yes, this will change your shell, and, uh, and, uh, you know, it is gonna warn you about that, because your shell is your, your whole, uh, outlook, your whole theme, not just the theme, actually, but your whole, uh, you know, change logos, or change icons, your shell is the whole, uh, theme pack all wrapped into one, so, if you don't feel comfortable changing your shell, then this isn't for you, but, you can you want to type in Vista Transformation Pack. Now you can either get here or you can go to crystalxp.net. By that you can just go to Google and type in Vista Bricka Pack, and you can get it from there. Uh, Vista Transformation Pack. Now there is Windows X Shrine, which I recommend. It's a great site, and you can get it here. And now this one, I don't have the add-on bar because I got mine for Crystal XP, but I didn't know that this one was actually a little bit better. As you see here, it's added DPI, auto detection and machine configuration, menu option for a Vista Styler toolbar, a lot of hotfix issues, uh, DPI uh, options, Vista Start menu port, even com for XP in 2003, and the Glass UI interface, and uh, added Windows Server 2003 service pack, a UX theme patching support, the fix to start or positioning bug there's another version previous to this one now see you get the whole look and feel you guess the really feel you get the feel of vista now you get the icons the folders which i love i love the, how the folders look on vista now i don't like vista itself vista wasn't really great operating system compared to other operating like mac os 10 t or leopard 10.5 you know, those are great, but Vista wasn't that great, but I agree, I do like the look of Vista, and it comes with, the one I got comes with Uber Icon, Y Shadow, but I only like Uber Icon, because if you look, watch when I open, uh, like, recycling bin, watch the icon, it comes into, like, 3D, looks like it's coming at you, and you have the loading, as you saw there, now, you can simply just go to the site, and this one comes, uh, I'll show you right here, as soon as it opens, oh, whoa, it comes with uh, I don't want to take too much time. So, you see, there's the look of it. It comes with the widgets bar that's on Vista, and that's really great. That's really cool. A widget bar comes with the search engine. Wow, I didn't know this one. See, uh, comes with the air glass look, the transparent thing, transparent toolbar, the orb. As you see here, see, mine's a little bit different, but see, this one actually has a search bar right here, which is really cool. The boot screen, the visual tooltip all wrapped into ones so i highly suggest this one and you just go to this site and i'll give you the link in the video description just click get vista transformation pack i'm not gonna do it now because i already have it and this will show you the features so make sure you read the stuff first and you know check if you like it make sure before you uh, do anything so this one's really really good and uh shows you a lot of things you can do with it and the downloads and discuss and there's even extras you can go to and get extras for Vista Transformation Pack. Now, if you don't like the Vista look, you can even go for the Longhorn concept, which is also here under Projects. You just go to Windows X Shrine. You can type that in in uh, uh, Google. Go to Visual Contents. And Visual Styles, you have Aeroglass. They have Longhorn XP UI. A lot of stuff. So, check it out. Uh, I am not, anyway, I'm not... Uh, 
on I'm not a work at, I don't work at Windows X Shrine, but I'm really want to recommend the site because it's a great great uh site for Vista Transformation Pack, and you can even see it right there at the top if you just want to go to Windows X Shrine, look at the top that will be there so you can just click up there it's way easier and that's actually a lot of news for windows and everything so uh... if you want to get a better look but not the actual os system uh... go for the transformation pack as your best bet i hope you enjoyed this video and uh... if you have any problems there is help support on the site so and be forewarned you are changing your shell so if you have avg and you search it will it won't detect the shell as a threat but it'll come up saying that your shell has been changed or edited but you already know that's your vista transformation pack so i uh, hope you enjoyed this video please comment rate my videos as well as subscribe thanks for watching